There are many times that as a minister, but also as a person, that I need to go apart for a while and just sit in the silence to recharge, to renew, to connect with God. I'm actually recording this ahead of time because I'm at Hope Hill, our, our cabin in the Georgia mountains, uh, where I sit on the front porch, I listen to the river, I do my writing there, much of it anyway, and I sit in the silence and commune with God. I ask you to do this wherever you are this weekend. It is a powerful recharge. You know, people think that they can recharge at night in sleep. Well, that recharges the body, but it doesn't recharge the soul. You need quiet time with God to restore the soul. The yearning to be still, to rest, and to enter into the silence is a prompting from God. It is a prompting of God calling you to turn within and to receive the fullness of the divine wisdom, life, and love. It is soul renewing. The silence is an invitation to become one again with God in your awareness. Now you're always one with God, but not so much in your awareness. The, the distractions of daily life, the noise, the busyness, it pulls you away from that awareness. You accept this invitation this weekend, and you rest in God's presence. And in the silence, you become gentle, especially gentle with yourself. You are able to gain a true perspective of your experiences, past, present, and even looking into the future. You're reminded that God loves you. You're reminded that God is with you. You're reminded that you're not alone. Quietness lets you reconnect with your loved ones. In your mind, you recall them. In your prayers, you uplift them. And you're one in spirit in prayer with your loved ones at that time. Even across a great distance, in the silence, you quietly and gently make a spiritual connection. See, prayer bypasses time and place. It is something that will cause a tremendous blessing that will bless you right where you are and bless the others that you're holding in prayer. It says in Psalm 62, verse 5, For God alone my soul waits in silence, for my hope is from God. Well, in the silence, I pray this weekend that you are blessed. Prayer does not take a long period of time. You can be changed in a millisecond. But the silence is that special place, that holy place, the sanctuary within you that you enter that changes your day. It changes you. It can change your life. I pray you have that experience. Amen.